Apple introduced three news iPhones today and as rumors suggested, the US tech giant has finally given its handsets dual SIM support. As I've written about before, being able to run two SIM cards at once, or even alternatively, isn't exactly an in-demand feature stateside due to various factors, but that feature is in high demand in other regions, particularly Hong Kong due to its proximity to China and tendency for locals to buy unlocked phones. While all the new iPhones released worldwide will support two SIMs, they actually can still only hold one SIM card, the second SIM support comes via ESIM technology, which is a virtual SIM of sorts that is still a very niche tech dependent on carrier support. China and Hong Kong, however, will get legitimately dual SIM iPhones, meaning its SIM trays will hold two SIM cards. Apple said it made the exception for Chinese iPhones because of China's resistance against ESIMs. I'm not sure how true that statement is, considering China Telcom launched an ESIM earlier this year. But the fact that Apple made a unique version of its new iPhones for the China shows how important the Chinese market is. ESIM may one day be useful, but right now it is a hassle. As mentioned earlier, not every carrier offers ESIM support, and even the ones that do, they require a registering process that locks said SIM account to the device. Moving one ESIM account from one device to another will require the user to contact their carrier and wait anywhere from hours to days. iPhone users in China and Hong Kong can freely swap any two SIM cards into their phones, useful for traveling to other countries, while other iPhone users will only be able to swap one around, because the secondary ESIM is locked to the device. I can see these true dual SIM iPhones from China and Hong Kong being resold in the European market at marked up prices. The new iPhones this year include two OLED models, iPhone XS and XS Max, and an LCD model, iPhone XR, with the OLED phones shipping September 21st to most regions, including Hong Kong and China. The XR will hit store shelves in late October.